Hey, Warrior family, Principal Hale here. Just wanted to reach out and tell you, uh, celebrate some of the fine things that's going on here at school. Last week we had uh, students of the quarter, we took out some good goodies to them, some treats and everything. Congratulations to those folks. Uh, last Friday we had an awesome turnout to our resource fair. We had 162 of you show up with your families. We had about five or 600 kids in total. Awesome stuff. Just want to say, make sure you're look, watching this news program because uh, these guys and gals are doing a wonderful job keeping you informed of all the great things that's going on here at Winburn. Keep up the hard work. Can't wait to see you back in this building. And now for the Warriors of the Week. The Maya Students of the Week for October 26th through 30th were Axel Roses Martinez, Trace Clift, and Clifford Henderson. The Knights Students of the Week were Zion Hill, uh, Brian Mar Martinez Estanas, and Shani Orozco Tema. The Seminole Students of the Week were Brianna Herrera, Maurice Garrison, and Prince Ngola. And the Hogwarts Students of the Week were uh, Lyland Hayes and Alden Wiseman for 6th grade, Billy Femeister for 7th grade, and Andrew Vichabanda for 8th grade. Thank you to everyone who submitted a piece for the Red Ribbon Week Art Contest. Last week, we showed you some of the great submissions that we got, but this week, we are announcing the winners. Winburn is getting its very own art club. You might be wondering, what is art club? Art club will be a place for young artists to practice their skills, develop their techniques, and collaborate within an artistic community. What will we be doing in art club? Students will be free to work on personal projects. They will also be given guidance through the artistic process. They um, will also be asked to share their progress and share their artwork so that way they can be given constructive criticism to keep improving their art. Um, so who will be running Art Club? Art Club will be run by Winburn's art teacher, Miss Easterling, and anybody is free to join. Um, what you, oh, also you join by emailing Miss Easterling and just telling her that you would like to sign up. So when is Art Club? Art Club will be meeting at 4 p.m. every other Thursday for 45 minutes. But um, one thing to note is that when we go back to in-person school, um, meeting dates and times can change. All right, that, that's all. All right, hey everybody, this is Miss Easterling, the art teacher here at Winburn. And Layla and I want to go over a really cool opportunity for you guys, another art opportunity about the Winburn Fall Art Showcase, the art exhibition going on. Um, okay, so I just have a couple questions just to like clarify what it is and like what you're doing. Um, first, like, can you just explain what the art showcase is? Yeah, so the art showcase is pairing with the orchestra and band, and we are creating this kind of virtual recital and exhibition for art. So it's open to seventh and eighth graders only, and um, it's going to be a virtual exhibition that actually the digital music class, Miss Salas's class, is going to be putting together in a really nice format for us. Oh, okay, and then I know you said like band orchestra and then like your class. So is that like all the types of submissions you're taking? Yeah, so we're taking um, for band and orchestra, you'd have to talk to those teachers more to get more information exactly what they're looking for. But for art, it can be any original work. It can be 2D, 3D, digital or photography, but it has to be something you've made. It can't be something you find from Google. It has to be original, something you've made. And all we're asking is that you take a picture of it 
and submit it to a Google form. So, and submit it with your name and your grade and a title if you have that. And then you can be entered into the showcase. You can submit up to two pieces. So if you have two works that you're really proud of or just one, you can submit either of them. And you can also, if you're confused on like what exactly an original work is, or if this would be a good submission for the art showcase, um, feel free to email me or ask your advisory teachers how to email me or how to contact me. Um, and I can help you kind of finish your piece and get it so that it's a really strong entry into our exhibition. Okay, and I think we have, we're going to be posting the links like for the news with those submission like forms and stuff. Uh, yeah. And then when is the submission deadline going to be? So all submissions have to, the submission deadline is November 20th. And you're right, the Winburn News is going to be posting the links. And there's actually two links to sign up, which can be kind of confusing. The first one is a sign up genius link, and it'll be the first one posted. And that's just where you reserve your spot. So we made that because I think a, a lot of people who haven't um, finished their artwork yet, or maybe haven't made something, but know they want to be a part of this, we went ahead and made them a link. So just so you can sign up, say your name is here and you wanna be a part of this. So you have to do that one. The first one is the sign up genius. The second link, which will also be posted is the actual art submission. So that's the Google form where you take a picture of your artwork and submit it. So make sure first one, sign up genius, get your spot reserved. Second, Google form, actually submit your artwork. Okay, and then is there anything else, like, just in general? Um, I think that pretty much covers it. November 20th is the deadline. This is only open to 7th and 8th graders. If you have any questions on what exactly is an original artwork, or if you need help on finishing a project, or if you need art supplies to create an artwork, please email me or ask any of your teachers how to contact me and we can get you um, anything you need and get the help you need. All right, um, your, her email will be on the like slide that we put up after this interview. So I think yeah, that's great. pretty much it. Yep, that's great. Thanks guys, really looking forward to seeing what you submit. And this just in, Winburn Warriors, for only $25 cash or check, you can have your own 2019-2020 yearbook today. All you have to do is contact Ms. Earnhardt or Mrs. Gregoire, and they will hook you up. Hope you get yours today. Thanks for coming out to the Fall Resource Fair and Trick or Treat. Over 100 families came, and over 5 metric tons of candy were given away. We can't wait to see you again. Winburn now has a Flipgrid shoutout page. You can find this link in your first period class teacher's canvas. On this Flipgrid, you can shout out any student or teacher you want. You can say that you miss them, you can say hi to them, you can say you appreciate them, just any shout out you want as long as it's positive. 
Uh, if you go to this Flipgrid, you can already see a few examples on there to help you make your own shout out. If you do shout out someone, it can really make their day. So I really recommend doing this. Shout out to Serenity from Second Hour. Okay. I want to shout out to Keontae. The next one, but he's the best friend that I ever had. But shout out to him. Shout out to him. Shout out to Serenity Dorsey. I want to give a shout out to every teacher with helping us with this virtual learning. Hi, Jack. I miss you so much. And shout out to all my best friends, the Corey, Madeline, and Jackie. And hi, Greg from 7th grade. You can catch me outside. We live right around the corner from each other. And shout out to Miss Wagle, my favorite awesome teacher from 6th grade reading. Peace. Uh, this is a shout out to Mr. Gonzalez and Mrs. Gonzalez for not killing me, for not having my news segments done. Um, yeah. <laughs> shout out to Mr. and Mrs. Gonzalez for not completely snapping at us yet for being so annoying during the news meetings. I just wanted to come on here really quickly and give a shout out to Senora Vasquez. She's just one of my favorite teachers and I really enjoy your class and I really enjoy learning Spanish. I love all the projects we do. They're always so hands on. I just made an alabrije last night and it was just so much fun to make and I just really enjoy her class and love her. Oh, a shout out to Carter Simpson for just being one of the best friends in the world. Yeah. Student Council is hoping to start a peer tutoring program at Winburn. Do you need extra help with your homework? Would you like a fellow student or peer to help you understand what you're learning? Then you can sign up for peer tutoring today using the link in your first period class, Teachers Canvas. Or, do you feel good about your work? Would you like to help other students feel good about theirs? Then you can sign up to be a peer tutor using the link in your first period class, Teachers Canvas. Tutoría entre iguales. ¿Necesitas ayuda con tu trabajo de escuela? Consejo estudiantil quiere empezar tutoría entre iguales en Winburn. Para ayudar si necesitas extra ayuda y alguien te puede ayudar con tu trabajo. Si te interesa, puedes registrarte en el enlace que está en cada mes de tu primera clase. Y ahora lo puedes hacer en español. ¿Quieres ayudar a tus compañeros con sus clases? ¿Eres un buen estudiante y quieres Ayudar a los estudiantes en Wembrook con su trabajo o tarea, puedes registrarte en el enlace que está en Canvas. Gracias. Hi, I'm Layla Bryant with the Wembrook newspaper, The Wembrook Watch. We're starting an advice call entitled Asking for a Friend, and we want your submission. You can choose to submit your name or remain anonymous, but ask us any appropriate questions you want our advice on, whether it's friendship, school, or whatever else is going on. Once again, it is completely anonymous and will respond on the Winburn Watch website when this month's edition comes out. Thank you, and I hope to see your submission. Remember when we voted for Winburn's hashtag and we chose these two? Hashtag Warriors for Life and hashtag Winburn Warrior Nation? Well, we have some exciting news. You can use these on Instagram, as you know, but you can also now tag Winburn's new official Instagram, Winburn underscore warrior underscore nation. They have a few posts already, so make sure to go check them out and follow them so you can see all the details and everything happening at school. Veterans Day is on Wednesday, November 11th. Many of our family members have served in the military. Army, Navy, Air Force, Marine Corps, National Guard. This year, we invite you to submit a photo of someone you know that served in the military so that we may honor them with a tribute on next week's Winburn News. Just follow the link at the bottom and follow the instructions.